Welcome everybody and this is how you connect to your Xbox remote and to your Xbox anywhere in the world and play your Xbox games anywhere in the world. As you can see, I am not connected to my home network. I am on my LTE um, plan, my, my cellular data as you can see in the top right. And you can see with using the Xbox streaming app, remote play, continue. Um, of course, I connected my, my controller as Bluetooth on my phone, and you can see here that I am connected. I am connected without being on my home network, so I am bending the rules a bit. How you do this is by port forwarding. I have an Orbi Netgear router, so you'll want to go to orbilogin.net, I believe. I'll show you step-by-step -step how I do it with my Orbi, um, but it is the same concept. Um, so you want to go to orbilogin.net or wherever uh, you manage your uh, internet settings, uh, your router settings. So if you click on attach devices, you'll see all your devices and it'll show the IP address. Uh, you'll see your Xbox IP there. Or you can go right to the port forwarding by going to advanced setup, advanced setup, port forwarding, and port triggering, and then click on add custom service. And that is where you get to here. Now you might want to pause this video to see where I'm at to make sure everything matches because right here is how you want to configure everything. You want to make sure your Xbox IP is selected. You can see how I have here circled uh, ending in 0.13. So you want to make sure your Xbox IP is selected. You want to make sure the port is 3074 and you'll want to make sure it's TCP slash UWP and hit apply and then you will be good to go. Now, if you don't have an Orbi, you just want to follow the same concept. You might just want to do a little bit of research of who is your router. If you don't have that and you don't know what to do, you can also find this information in command prompt and run ARP A. Just as shown here, it'll list, it'll list all your IPs. So you'll need to individually ping each IP as you can see right here. I eventually found that 0.13 is my Xbox IP. It will say pinging Xbox, and that's how you can figure it out. But I do recommend going into your uh, router settings to see if you can find this first, because that's easier. But then you want to go into your Xbox, uh, your store, your app store on your phone. Find the Xbox app. I already have it downloaded, so you just upload it. Um, I'm sorry, not upload. I'm going way too fast. Um, you open it, and um, that's pretty much all there is to it. And just like I showed you in the beginning of the video, you uh, you just add your Xbox. I already have it added, and you can just click on Remote Play on this device, and things should work flawlessly. Um, you can add your Xbox controller. You do need to do that. Um, you can add it as a Bluetooth device, and you'll be good to go. Now, if you want to fast forward to see gameplay, it's like the last 30 seconds of this video, so feel free if you wish. And I do apologize about having this video kind of upside down, uh, turned over to the side a bit. I just wanted to show you everything working and uh, just how everything works in a raw video. <laughs> so I appreciate everyone's understanding on that. So, I will show you gameplay in a bit. I am going to launch NBA 2K22, and as we can see, it is launching. I do have my controller connected. Um, just ignore this error. It's because I didn't quit out of the game before disconnecting my controller. But other than that, please comment and um, let me know if you have any questions or concerns. Please check the description also, because I also plan to update the description and be more specific with other router settings. Uh, so if you don't see your router listed in the description for uh, direct instructions about that, please comment in the comments and I will uh, try my best to be of assistance. But this is gameplay. You'll see here, I will just launch freestyle mode. Um, of course, uh, how good your LTE network is or um, your Starbucks connection is uh, will deter determine how well this works. But other than that, thanks for watching, everybody. Please comment. Please share this video to the world if you like it. Spread the good news and check out these other videos I have popping up. But other than that, thanks for watching and I hope you have a good day.